So if you want to take out that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. If you want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Broken arm! Broken arm! Broken arm! Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Today's video takes us to 1304 West 2nd Street in Los Angeles, California, home of the Belmont Station Apartments. Oh, dearie me, that was supposed to be an undisclosed location, at least according to Sidewalk Boy. He gives too many hints on where he's at, and it doesn't take a master detective to figure it all out. At any rate, the poor lad is scared the entire time he's in the apartment building, and then once he goes outside, he's continually looking over his shoulder. I'd be worried too, no doubt about that. <laughs> Joy! Hell yeah, let's do this. Hell yeah, I got a lot of supporters in here. Tune in, tune in. Hell yeah. That's what I like to hear, everyone. Hey, big badass, super, super 23, what up? Sidewalk boy, you're at an undisclosed location, huh? You're not in your mama's apartment building there in Koreatown, are you, sonny boy? Well, the inside of that building looks a little too nice for the Koreatown building. I don't know. Where are you at? Oh, you're not over at KC Camera Boy's apartment building, are you? Uh-huh. You guys try, but you're your haters. You still watch my content. Eh? It's that simple. You still watch it. <laughs> you notice how every time there's a sound behind him, he has to turn around. You simpleton, you're going to be going through the rest of your life the same way always looking behind you to see what those footsteps are about. How's that going to make you feel, sweetheart? Where's well, Solulo West? Thank you. Look at the little punk. His head is on a swivel. He's constantly looking over his shoulder. I think that might be his mama's apartment building. It looks like it's the same kind of windows there. Are you that stupid to broadcast from your mama's apartment building, you cockroach? Hey, Mike G, thank you for those 20 bucks. I will always appreciate that. Actually, let's go down here. My peeps. Hell yeah, thank you for those 20 bucks, Mike G. I appreciate it. Always, always. Two points to make here. First, Mike, you're a fool to donate $20 to this moron. And secondly, very sad that you have to walk around an apartment building with a bulletproof vest on. Are you expecting problems, sweetheart? So I'm back here, everyone. Hell no, my channel never down. You can bring me down. That's how simple it is, everyone. Yeah, still down, everyone. So it appears that the 
fool thought he was in an undisclosed location, but his camera reveals the street address, which I looked up. The Belmont Station Apartments. Oh, very nice. There's the chandelier that we saw a few minutes ago. He was standing by. Yeah, so it's not an undisclosed location after all. That must be fairly expensive. I don't think you'll be able to afford to live in there. Mmm. I could see there's a lot of supporters in here. But I love you haters. Keep on, you thought you'll bring me down. You'll never bring me down. <laughs> hey, thank you for those $20, Mike G. The Noah, thank you for the money donation. Yes, he needs lots of donations. It's that simple. Got to go to Taco Bell, huh? Ooh, good thing your mama was getting food stamps there. You wouldn't have been able to eat. <laughs> There's just haters in here. I don't get it. Why? So I'll be posting good fire content at everyone. It will be good fire content. I will come stronger than stronger. Triple the stronger. Does anyone know what this buffoon is babbling about? And notice how he's still looking around. He's looking from side to side. That must be terrible to live like that. Man, I'd have some dark glasses on, I'm telling you. Ooh, I'd be scared to walk down the streets of L.A. L.A. is a big city. Ooh, there's a lot of people that don't like you there, mama. There's some ignorant people that see the video and they don't know what happened, but that's ignorance. They couldn't get me once. What do you think they're going to be able to do it again? <laughs> Sidewalk boy, if ignorance is bliss, you must be in euphoric heaven by now. Look at you. You're gloating because you got your channel back. Oh, we'll just have to work that much harder to make sure it stays down next time. You tried that once, but you didn't succeed. It's that simple. You tried that once, but you didn't succeed. They took me off for a couple of days. Hey, the crazy boy, five for three of blogs. I saw your video. You're doing wrong, the crazy boy, five or three vlogs. If I were you, Richard, and thankfully I'm not you, I would shut my mouth right about now because there's plenty of people out there in the Latino community who don't like you. Is that why you keep looking over your shoulder? And you'll continue to look over your shoulder. If I were you, I'd move to, say, San Francisco. Hell yeah, everyone. <laughs> hey, Mexican Rachis, thank you. These fools continue to donate to this moron. I pity the fool. No doubt, I pity the fool. These people are brainwashed into thinking that Sidewalk Boy is doing something good for the community. It just proves that YouTube is an entertainment forum and people are not interested in First Amendment rights. They're only interested in this fool going out harassing and provoking people into a reaction. That's the end of the story. That's it. There's a lot of supporters and some hater. I have plenty of new content to come out and it's gonna be a good one. Stay tuned everyone. I still get donated money. Simple as it gets. Well, let's see. You won't get a YouTube check for a while, but next time you do, make sure you stand there and count out your 100s and your $50 bills or maybe your 20s and 10s because it won't be that much money considering you were off the air for a little while. And now the algorithm has killed your videos, hasn't it? Or well, you haven't figured it out yet because you're not that smart. Hell yeah.
<laughs> so I'll be bringing fire cannon in. Everybody thought I was gone, huh? But you were wrong. I'm not gone. I'll be back at it fully strong, guys. Oh, you're back all right, sidewalk boy. But remember, you will always be a few cans short of a six-pack. Not to mention a few fries short of a Happy Meal. Oh, yeah. And by the way, are you still coming to take our cars, our houses, our beds we sleep in, and our wives as well? You're a really sick and twisted individual, my man. Hey, Mike G. Thank you for donating. You've been a two subscriber. I appreciate it. The Crazy Boy 503 Blogs. I wish I could have us uh, talk to talk of what happened. Have a talk on what happened? Oh, you mean that you had that hard-working lady arrested that didn't do anything to you and you cried like a little baby that she touched your camera? Is that what you would have a talk about, Sidewalk Boy? I just don't get it, everyone. Just don't get it. There's still a lot of support right here, but you don't get it, huh? <laughs> sure, sure, sure. The inept imbecile just stands there and laughs for no reason. Could be because he's like another idiot on YouTube that he used to hang out around with before he broke up with his lover, Casey Camerboy. Roll that clip. <laughs> it's called, what is it called? I have a lot of support in here. I appreciate it, the ones, the ones who stood with me. But there's a lot of haters though, and they still keep watching my videos. It's a funny thing. Oh, yes, indeed. We're still going to watch your videos, but we're watching them until you slip up. We're waiting for you to make mistakes, and that way we can take action against you and next time you won't be so lucky because youtube's not so forgiving on the second time your channel's taken down of course you'll find all that out sweetheart if you don't like me don't watch my videos it's that simple you could do another one you could be watching another person don't watch my content eh? it's that simple everyone How scared this mama's boy is looking around all the time. And you can't go anywhere in public because you don't know who your enemies are. You're like the scarecrow from the Wizard of Oz. You have no brain. Yeah, I make your own videos about you. But I'm back, everyone. I'm out, everyone. It was just a quick update. I'll be doing videos every day and I'll be in good content. Thank you, everybody. I'm out. Peace. I'm out. Well, there you have it, folks. His undisclosed location isn't such a big secret after all, now, is it? And remember what the lad always says. If you don't support the First Amendment, you don't belong in America. He should take his own advice. I don't know what country would take him. Canada doesn't want him, and neither does Mexico. Perhaps South America would take him? I don't know. Maybe Russia. He could fight with the Russian army. For real freedom, huh? How about that? No doubt. I'll be watching his stream closely. You can bet on that, my friends. You can bet your last donated dollar on that sidewalk, boy. No doubt. If you enjoy watching idiots imbeciles and morons on my channel please subscribe as always thanks so much for stopping by cheers to that